me, but my grades weren't good enough to get into Howard University. So my second choice was Grambling State University. Um, and I, I got accepted to Grambling State University, HBCU. Um, I studied theater and physics there. My major was uh, physics and I changed it to theater after I met the uh, head of the theater department and he told me, hey, you, you might have something. And I, um, and I um, became a, a thespian there at the school. And um, I don't know, my, I've always done some kind of art in some kind of way. And I've always wanted to, to go to school because at that time, it was a, a thing that our parents and grandparents weren't really able to do. That wasn't a thing, you know, to do. So it made them so very proud. It's a, lo a lot different now because there are so many different ways to fulfill your um, your your dreams and your career as a as a human being in, in different fields of study and choice. I mean, and we're in the age of Aquarius. I mean, we got <laughs> we got the internet where to this point you can Google anything. It's like the Matrix. You can learn anything you want as quickly as you want. You don't have to spend all your money uh, hmm. in, in a college uh, fund or, or, or on education like you used to. And But I still say we should support HBCUs because those are the first universities, public and private, that allowed us to uh, get a formal education. And um, really, I think education should be free across the board. And we're going to continue to fight for that. And people like Robert uh, Johnson and um, Robert Smith and, and, and Jay-Z and, and Snoop Dogg and people who are fighting and, and paying for children's educations, college educations and things like that are very important and should be respected in the society. You know, so in, in, any way you want to go, I don't think there's a wrong way to grow yourself or become um uh, uh, an educated human being who has something to offer to society. There's no wrong way to do that. Um, but I, I do say support HBCUs because it's our heritage, you know, and it's lightweight our responsibility, you know, if, if, if that is part of your uh, passion. There we go. To be a student. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks. There we go. Now, as of all my parents, I'm saying I ain't hold the time up, but for all my parents who got a, a student that's in high school right now, and you, like you say, you have to learn to grow with your kids. You know what I'm saying? What kind of advice can you give your parents? You know, or these parents is told that. To parents? Yeah, that's got high school students in the school life. To the parents. Um, if you have a graduating uh, senior right now, I think you should be very, very proud because they made it. And um, I think they are making really smart decisions. I really do. I think just this generation... Uh, has something to say and something to offer. Um, I believe um, I believe they will lead us to a place that we've never been before. And uh, I say support your 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 kids to the parents, and also don't take your foot off their neck either, Thanks. because as much as they resist it, they appreciate it. They appreciate it later. You know, they want guidance. You know but they just want the freedom to feel like they're making their own decisions. And that's what I've learned about being a parent. I have a 11 year old, I have a 16 year old and I have a 22 year old. So I have a chance to kind of really think about the decisions that I make when I'm having dialogue with these, these children who are young human beings and young adults. Um, they're ready to lead us. And, um, for those of you who are parents and your child did not graduate or chose to not go that route, you know, uh, to f follow through with the whole high school career, it's okay too. You ain't got to do that. Mm -hmm. You ain't got to do that. I mean, it's, it's so many ways right now and there's so many choices. I think each step is the way, you know, as long as they're taking steps forward. And make sure you stay on their ass about just if they want to stay on the game all day and all of that. That's the wrong way. You can't play the game all day. You can't be on TikTok all day. You can't do that all day. But but let me let me object a little bit because you got the gamers who making like millions of dollars on the on the certain certain games. You know what I'm saying? But you either got it or you don't. So you can find it out. Well, if you're on the game all day, that means that you're not off the game planning 
uh, how to make money on the game. Mm -hmm. So if if you and, and Puma discuss, me and Puma had this discussion last night. Puma's my 16 year old. She was like, Mom, I could be an influencer and be making lots and lots of money doing this. I said, Well, you can't do that if all you're doing is making making videos. You have to at some point put some plans together, make some plans, write some things down, and um, plan your work, then work your plan. Mm -hmm. Because that takes, it takes, um, it's fun and it's easy, and just because it's easy and it's fun to you doesn't mean that it's not valuable. And spend your time wisely. If you wanna become an influencer, I think that's smart. Or a gamer, I think that's smart. It's very smart in this economy because uh, billions of people are, um, or users, you know, that can be your potential audience and patrons. But you got to study. You got to learn how to market. You got to learn how to sell what you're doing. And you have to become really good at your craft. You know, whatever that is. So you can study. Thanks. Plan it out. Don't just tell me I'm going to be this or that and, and you're not moving toward it. It ain't going to be I'm, abracadabra. I'm not even going to cut off. It's 979 to beat. Get Delcy Pop Station right in my face. 97.9 to She's screaming in the back. You need to be watching her face right now. Erica Bobby, no, 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 no. She said, what up, South Dallas? She said, what up, East Dallas? Four first, top six. She's giving this game. Hey, she's in the mix. I'm going to hold up a little bit more on her time.